Senator from Wyoming. Mr. President, just yesterday, the White House went out and applauded the fact that uh, Saudi Arabia is creating more and producing more oil. The president goes to Brazil and he tells the president of Brazil, we want to be your number one customer. This is at the same time that this White House is blocking American energy projects and American energy jobs. Uh, held hostage by environmental extremists, this president continues to block and cause people to lose jobs in the United States. Earlier this week, the number, one coal, the number three coal producer in the country lay, is announced the layoff of 1,200 workers. So not only are Americans who are working in energy losing their jobs, the President's policy is continuing to block new jobs from being created. The President continues to stand in blockade of the Keystone XL pipeline, which would bring about thousands of family-paying wage jobs. Yet the President says no. And then Harry Reid, the majority leader, stands at that desk and he blocks over a dozen bills passed by the House of Representatives that are good American energy jobs that will put people back to work. Republicans here stand ready to produce more American energy, which will put people back to work, will stimulate our economy, and will help lower energy costs for American families. The American people deserve better than they're getting from the Democratic majority in the Senate and from the Democrat President of the United States.